Hello everyone, welcome back to Arx Fatalis. My current objective is to go through the goblin-controlled territory to reach the king and inform him of the atrocities that have happened at this castle. To do that, I need to reach the bar to get the authorization from the guy that I freed from jail. So let's go try to find the bar, or the, the tavern I suppose you'd call it, and also just explore around and try to pick up stuff. So I think there's some lilies over here. More water. Regeneration ring. Hello. Uh, you can keep your bones, skeleton. Another Anakar's rock. I still have no idea what those are for. You know, I really want to know if I can kill rats. You can! But is there any point? No, they don't even give you anything. Damn it. I'm sorry. That might have been that rat's little brother. Aww. Anyway, let's take a look at the ring. Okay, can I equip that? Okay, there we go. That is like the worst ring icon I've ever seen. That is atrocious. Oh my god. So, is it all the slots I have? Just two ring slots and then... I'm assuming there's like an upper body slot or maybe a helmet slot. It's hard to tell because there's no actual, like, slot indicators as far as what I can wear here. Hmm. Okay, well, I wonder if that makes me regenerate health. Most likely it does. What was this? Looks like a portal to another dimension or something. One that's broken. Ooh, what is that? A spell casting ring. Casting plus 10%. Ooh. Wow. I actually never found that last time I played. Somebody's talking. I think that's the tavern. So it's obviously somewhere very close. In fact, I think that looks into the tavern right there. Probably just go around to the left up here, I think. Yeah, it's gotta be through there. Yep. Can I go this way though? Nope. By the way... I think I saw something up there on that little ledge. Question is though, yeah. Yep, 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 but how do I get it? <laughs> yeah, what the hell is that? I mean, this isn't like System Shock 2. I don't have some sort of psi ability to grab objects to me. So... The hell? Um, I guess I could throw stuff at it? I don't think I can throw stuff that far. Uh. Oh shit, never mind, you can. Well, I'm never getting that back. Okay, well, obviously if I throw an object at it from this direction, that's stupid. I'm really curious what that is run out of stuff, though. Um, what if I throw some dough at it? Let it dough! It's gonna be some dirty-ass bread. <laughs> ah. Yeah. Hmm? Oh, oh, I'm never gonna get it back now. God damn it. Okay, so that's too high. <laughs> this is ridiculous. That's too low? What the hell? That is not working right. Just 
getting stuck on nothing. Shit. Hold on, hold, hold on, hold on. What if I get up there on the wall? Because I can get up there. But what good would that do? I couldn't jump to it, right? Hmm? Actually, maybe I could jump to it. Hold on. I might be able to make it. Look at this. This is... That's a, that's a pretty far jump. I also might break this old man's legs in doing so, but let's give it a shot. Let's, uh... Let's take this with me. Calm down, chicken. Oh, there's a scroll up there, too. Damn it. <sighs> can I even jump through this? Shit, I don't think I can. How in the hell? There's gotta be, like, a levitate ability, right? Some sort of a spell. Like, I don't think you could really get that otherwise. I don't even know if, if you throw an object into another object, if that can move it. Is that even the, the case? Let's find out with this rather grim object to test with. Shit. God damn it, stop getting stuck in everything. <laughs> Stupid shield. They can't even bump objects, can they? No, it's, it's not. It wouldn't even work. Even if I hit it, it wouldn't bump it. All right, so there's got to be some sort of a, a spell. Okay, well, I'll file that away in my mind. I'll most likely forget it. Never getting that bread back, am I? <clears throat> hey, doggy. Hey, doggy. Oh, oh you so cute. It's weird when I click it, it sounds like I'm hurting it or something. I just want to pet you. I think he actually follows you around. Doesn't he? Yeah, he does. Hey, you want some food? What do dogs eat? Carrots? Dogs are like horses, right? Maybe not. Uh... Cheese? Do dogs like cheese? There you go. Apparently they don't. Okay. There you are. Hello, my friend. Pulsius, will you sign false papers for me? Give me official paper. Then me do that. Which one is it? Uh, here we go. There. Your paper's in order, friend. Thank you very much. Signed Goblin Authorization. Delivered by Anatoly. Welcome to the Yellow Tulip, stranger. Thank you. you. Can relax. You'll always be welcome here, as long as your coin holds out. It always does. Fine establishment you've got here. My name is Am Shigar. Pleased to meet you, handsome. I'm Tizzy, the owner of this fine establishment. And though I'm acquainted with most of the rogues and scoundrels here in Arks, I don't remember seeing you around. Are you from the Traveler's Guild? But, <laughs> I forget myself. 
What can I do for you? Nothing in particular right now. How much for a drink? Just two gold for our finest, sweetheart. I feel very short. Is it because... Ah, yes, it's simply higher back there. Okay. So I guess I'm not that short. Also, I'm Shigar. You need to speak up. I can barely hear him. Ah, oh, quit your staring. A girl could get ideas. The outpost has I... been attacked by the ills. Have you got a new lot on top? I don't really like it when people rummage about and everything. Bring me a drink, sweetheart. It shouldn't take the master long to reach his goal now. What the hell? What? That conversation made no sense. What does it say? Ten gold pieces for a bottle of wine tizzy. Can I just, like, steal wine? Or does it, like, automatically take the money out if no, I, I haven't use it? Seen any dwarves around here in a long time. Hmm. I bet he died in the crypt. Dirty tomb hey, uh, do you mind if I steal your cheese down there? Get out of oh. here before I call the guards! Sorry. I'm sorry. Did you know that this place dates back to when there was still a sun in the sky and we lived above ground? It was called the Yellow Rose then. Funny, isn't it? Probably no more roses anymore. I think there's a place that requires a password back here. Password. Open this door. <laughs> I'm Shigar, you're not very bright, are you? Password. Uh, it's me. Open up. <laughs> Password. Akba? <laughs> oh, Amshigar. Come closer. Come closer. I can feel that luck is with us today. Hey there, you look Try lost. Try your luck in the game. Come on and over and have with a your drink. Pockets Take a load of off. Gold. I'm Enoil Kalpal. And this little rat hole is my favorite haunt. Now why don't you tell me a little about yourself? Actually... I'm having trouble with my memory. Can you tell me who I am? <laughs> You're a trusting soul. Sorry, friend. But as I said, I've never laid eyes on you before. No one around here look familiar to you? Maybe you were with the Guild of Travelers and some horrible disaster befell them, leaving you to wander around traumatized. Or maybe some thug hit you on the head and lifted your purse. Who's to say? Well then, tell me about this place. Well, this here is a bar. Folks come in here to drink and complain. But maybe you meant the bigger picture. You must have really smacked your noggin. We live down here in these old mines because our sun flared out some years ago and left the topside world a frozen wasteland. But how many people live here and where can I find this guild of travelers that I might belong to? You know, I'm not really sure just how many of us there are crammed down here. Besides us, man, you've got your goblins, dwarves, trolls. Then you've got different factions of each. Hard to say, really. As for the Traveler's Guild, they're a bunch of hard-to-kill bastards who keep the lines of communication and trade open between us and all the other rat-hole cities. It's supposed to be a long, tough trek between cities, so we don't see them too often. Maybe a while before we see another group. You can always find me here if you ever need me. Well, sounds like it would actually be fun to be in the Guild of Travelers. Adventure! Also, I saw some writing up here. Yeah, I actually never noticed this. Ever. Like, last time I played or when I originally played. But I just noticed it right now. Some words carved on a stone. If you... Traveler, if you want to take part in my treasure hunt, you will need an emerald to open my chest. Oliver. Hmm? Is this related to the secret word I need to get inside of that place, or... Been a while since I mean, what chest? I bet he died in the crypt. Dirty Tomb Raider that he is. Dirty Tomb Raider? What? <laughs> I guess Laura Croft is pretty dirty in the newest Tomb Raider. Always covered in muck and grime. I heard a rumor at the tavern about a treasure hunt organized by a hermit called Oliver. Apparently, the way to start the hunt off is to drop an emerald into into his chest. Do you mean cut up, cut him open and put an emerald inside of his chest cavity, or do you mean another chest? I don't know what which chest you speak of. 
The outpost has been attacked Every by the Ilse. Every bloody day I eat chicken. What chest? Had what chest? Out. Well, I suppose I need to find Oliver first, I guess. Hmm. Alright. Whoa, that is a cool weapon you've got in your bag, man. What is that? Looks like a Klingon blade of some sort. Were you the dude complaining about chicken? Hello? Hello? I guess I can't talk to him. Every bloody day I eat chicken. I've had enough. It's been a while since we saw Azrael Darkthorn. I bet he died in the crypt, dirty tomb raider that he is. Okay, well he's sick of chicken, so what if I give him like Um Cheese. There you go. You eat it. You can eat it. Mmm, <laughs> crotch cheese. I'm just gonna take that back now. Alright, I'm gonna go. This is getting awkward. Rules of the game? Okay, yeah, simple. Simple, simple thing. Welcome, stranger. My name is Rinko. You can win lots of gold with me. If you want to know the rules of the game, just read them. They're pinned up on this wall. Now I think it's actually a 50-50% game as far as like how much you win and lose. In the end, more I Let's see. Yeah, if you win, you'll be given 100 gold pieces, otherwise you'll lose 10 gold pieces. So you get... You get 10 times what you put in. And there's 10 different numbers. So unless I'm missing something, I'm pretty sure you just break even in the long term. So, uh, well, I suppose it doesn't even ma really matter if I play then, but what the hell. Let's go with eight. Come on, come on. Never oh. fear. Fortune is fickle. Soon she will smile on you. I actually barely have any money. I probably shouldn't play again. But I'm going to anyway. Come on, eight. Come on, eight. Motherfucker. I'm sure you'll have better luck next time. Apparently the Ills I'm just gonna keep playing until I'm poor. Never fear. Fortune is fickle. Ah. And she will smile on you. Ah. I'm sure ah. you'll have better luck next time. God damn Never it. Never fear. Fortune is fickle. Soon she will smile on you. You're supposed to break even in this game, and somehow I managed to lose money. Well, that went well. Try it now. Follow your lucky star. By the way, gambling is stupid. Never do it. I think it's time to go. Password. Open this door. Open the fucking door, man. Hey, doggy. Hey, doggy. Okay, well, now I can go back and get into the goblin's territory. So let's go do that. Pretty lights. Hot human, you enter Goblin Kingdom. Humans is not allowed, except gem dealers. Well, it's funny you mention that. Cuz... I'm a dealer, here's my license. Everything in order. You passing now. 
But careful! Human rebels is escaped from our prison not long ago. Only dealers allowed passing. A rebel, you say? What a terrible person. I'll let you know if I see him. Bless you. Okay, where the hell was it? Uh, I think it's up here. Yeah, here we go. Okay. And then I think I yeah, I still need the authorization, right? You are not Jim Dealer Badge and signed authorization. Not now. Me may be happy with little present. Okay. Here we go. There we go. You come in. Important card of Lord Alatar, stupid human. <laughs> yes, I'm the stupid one. Actually, my character is kind of dumb. Move on, Midboard. You know, I actually just seriously forgot my character's name again. What the hell is he called? He just said it, and I remembered it for like a, a little while, and now I forgot it again. Let's see what the range on this spell is. Ah, pretty good, I got three. some more spiders here. Ooh, a flower. Yoink. If only I had a flare, I would love to drop one down there. Because the range on the torch is not very far. Alright, let's pick a direction and let's go into it. Let's go... Yeah, let's go this way. Open the gate and let me pass. None human allowed. I'm no ordinary human, I'm a gem dealer. Open the gate. Trolls on strike! No gem trade today. You're not coming in. Now come, open up. Mm, no. <laughs> okay, so I think I need to get the trolls working again or something if I want to be let through. You not mess with us, human! Damn you! And there's a troll over there. I like the trolls. I love their voice acting in particular. You not... What the hell? I, th I think the sound file messed up because it just stopped playing. Are you talking to me? There we go. <laughs> That's my favorite one. Come on, do it again. <laughs> it's amazing. Roar! Angry troll. You're adorable, come on. You're a softie. Yeah, this guy's just gonna tell me the same thing. Here, look at my magics. Damn Boom. Didn't even have to look at it. You not pass. You not friend. Me turn you to rat food if you not go away. What 
the hell was that? Was he eating or was that him humming? It's like yum 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 yum. Okay, so I don't think there's much down here except a bunch of like uh, a bunch of water lilies and stuff like that. But let's gather them up for future potions. I still have no idea how to brew potions. I'm assuming I'm missing something. Like like an item, some sort of a brewing kit or something. Some alchemy, alchemical laboratory. Laboratorium. Libraratorium. I think there's another... Anakar's Rock up here. Yep, there it is. Still don't know what they're for. There's also these gemstones. Which, you know, I am supposed to be a gem dealer, so I suppose I'm supposed to have gems on me. But I don't actually know how to actually get them. Like, I'm assuming I need some, like a pickaxe, probably. But I don't have one. Uh, does the hammer work? I don't think it does. No, and I'm pretty sure I've tried attacking them, too. Yeah, it doesn't work. I, I think I need a pickaxe or something of the sort. And there's just a dead end. The hell was that noise? It's a weird thumping noise. Hmm. So I'm going to explore around a little bit more, but for the most part, I think I just need to go exploring uh, down where the spiders are. So this is actually about as far as I've played myself. When I just revisited this game, just uh, recently. So at this point, I'm actually not entirely sure what to do. So I just came from up there. Let's see what's around here. I think it's a level transition. Where does this go? Ah, yes. I think there's just more spiders up here. Alright, well, let's have a nice little cook-off here. It just sunk through the fire. I can grab it, right? Okay, good. Look at all the bread. Mmm. Hold on, can I combine the bread with, like, cheese or something? No. Any more? Oh, that's it. Alright, I think I've got some fresh fish. Hey, 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 get away from me. Yeah! It's a tough one. He just dodged me. MLG rat. Well, now I've got some more ribs to cook. I wonder if I can, like, combine the mushrooms with the ribs to make, like... I don't know, something. Some sort of a more complete dish. I don't actually know the recipes. Aside from bread... And I know there's apple pie that's possible, but I'm not sure how to make it. Wait. I'm missing a rib. I'm missing a rib! Where did my other rib go? Yeah, I looted two and I put two down. Where's the other one? Oh, there it is. Okay. Freaking glitchy ribs. Alright, I think I'm good. A more processing I can do. Don't need to do that, but... Feels good. There we go. Lots of colorful powders. Alright. Oh, hi. Oh. Come back here. 
fucking bad. Got him with the tip. This just feels like such classic RPG gameplay, you know? I'm in a dungeon, a dark dungeon, and I'm fighting rats and spiders. It's so classical. It's almost quaint. But for some reason, even though oftentimes this, this would annoy me in a newer game, like really I'm fighting rats again, but for some reason, it actually feels... really neat. I don't know why. Let's go this way. So many torches. I just love the gathering aspects. Starting fires, baking bread, mixing ingredients. It's very cool, very satisfying. Piece of wood. Hold on, is that a handle? Yeah, I think it's a handle. Uh, lever. But for what hole? Gotta put it somewhere. That looks like a boss. Come here. I better save it, actually. That thing looks nasty. Eh. Eh. <laughs> Damn it. Oh, shit. That did a lot of damage. Oh my god, how much health do you have? Jesus Christ, come on. Oh, I think my ring of regeneration is working, because my health is actually going up. Oh shit, that hurt. Hold on. Hold on. Shit. I need to heal. There we go. This thing is really tough! How many freaking hits do you take? Ah. Fuck, I need to do it again. Alright, I can take one more hit before I need to heal once again. Whoa, am I drunk? Shit, what the hell is happening? I think I'm drunk. Fuck, I had too much wine. It's fine. Fucking die already! <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. Oh no! Oh, Jesus, I got stuck. Is this thing invincible? What the hell? You can die, right? You, you're mortal. Yeah. Oh, I thought I killed it. I just did double damage. <laughs> yeah. 
Okay, I finally killed it. Wow, holy shit. I'm gonna give myself a pat on the back for that one. Holy crap. It didn't even drop anything. Did it give me XP at least? Uh, experience points need to get to next level 1360. I'm not sure how many I had before I killed it. Hmm. Damn. Yeah, by the way, actually, something I totally forgot to cover before is that there's actually directional attacks. So it's not just random which way you attack. It, it's kind of like, uh... It's sort of Mountain Blade style in the sense that it depends on which way you're moving. So if you start going to the left, it's like this. If you start going to the right and then attack, it's like this. If you go back and then attack, it's uh, sort of a forwards stabbing motion. And this way is overhead. So my my uh, my current most... My most... Um, what's the right word? I'm not sure what the right word is. Favored. That's the word. My most favorite attack is currently the one that goes back. This one. Because it's really good for hitting them when you're out of range. Because it's a nice forward stabbing motion. So yes, there are directional attacks. Alright, there's gotta be something good down here. <gasps> oh shit, it's an emerald! That can be used, uh, put into that Oliver's chest. I, I don't know where his chest is, but it apparently can be put into it to start the treasure hunt. That is so cool. Okay, well, if I ever find it, I shall put it in. And I am not going to sell that. Do not sell the emerald. Look at that tiny little thing. So pretty. That is so cool. Alright, that was definitely worth it. I suppose I could have just jacked it and run. some rope. I actually don't have room for it. Okay, I've got to ditch some stuff. Yeah, I definitely need to ditch some stuff. Okay, let's process some ingredients. Oh my god, I've got so many ferns. Let's, uh, let's move some stuff around. No, move the whole stack. For the love of god, thank you. There we go. Gotta hold down shift to move the whole stack. Yeah, the inventory system is not great. It's a bit clumsy. It's not bad, but it's a bit clumsy. Okay, what do I not need? Leaks. I probably don't need leaks. I don't want to keep almost everything. Logbook. Hey, wait, I never read the logbook, did I? I don't think I did. Okay, I don't actually know if I need these uh, blacksmith's hammers. I feel like I do. Hmm. Alright, well, let's ditch a sword. This one's 23 out of 50. Ditch that one, put on the 50 out of 50. Beyond that, I'll eat some bread. I don't know if I need these many mushrooms. I need like a... I need a freaking storage chest. Wish there was an auto sword button. I don't believe there is. I don't think I need these arrows. Since I don't intend to use a bow and I don't even have a bow. Okay. I think I'm good. Alright. Hopefully there's somewhere to actually use this rope. Because otherwise, if it's not used on the environment to get me somewhere, it is completely pointless. Well, I suppose unless I want to hang myself, but I really don't want to.
Okay, where is left to go? Looking at the map, up in that way, up in that way. Wait, those stairs? I've been here before. Like off camera when I was checking out the game, I came to this cave here, but I don't think I ever saw these stairs. That's a level transition, holy shit. Okay, wow, I don't think I ever, I think I missed that. Uh, let's go there last. Let's explore the rest of this. Stupid stalactite. Damn you, stalagmite and stalactites. Getting all up in my grill. My grill. Got so many mushrooms. I need to do something with them, I just don't know what. God, die already. Alright, I hear a bunch of spidery legs slithering about like snakes. Because that's exactly what spiders sound like. Snakes. You know, I actually want to know how much XP these things give me. Hold on. Two, six, seven, four. Now let's kill one. Okay. Two, six, seven, four. Two, six, seven. Okay, so it gave me gave me ten XP, which is almost nothing. Hopefully the bigger ones give me more. Two six seven four, and then I killed one more. Two six eight four, two six nine four. So two six nine four, nine four. Okay, so it looks like the bigger ones gave me twenty. Yeah. Okay, they gave me twenty. That's still not very much, though. It's almost nothing. Man, I need somewhere to drop my powders. But too many alchemical ingredients. Okay, that loops around, so where have I not been? That's where I came from, so I've not been here. Which just loops around. I think I've been everywhere down here except up the stairs. Yeah, looks like I have. Alright, let's go check out those stairs. This is not the right way. Here we go, it's on my left. Maybe it's not. Shit. Where was it? Here? Here it is. Yeah, I have no idea where the hell this goes. Lord, we have located an energy flux. Another one. Why are the immortals never content with their own dimension? But that is our eternal duty, I suppose. To ensure that the universal equilibrium is maintained. Where is the origin of the energy channel? An otherwise unremarkable world called Exhausta. The supplicant expired before he could finish the communication. What should we do, Lord? Let us send a guardian. What the hell was that? Send a guardian. 
Am I the guardian? I have no idea what that was about. Okay, uh, is this a city? It feels like a city. I hear blacksmith hammers. Hmm. Hello? Welcome to Ark, sir. Go straight to the guard room and introduce yourself to Carlo, please. Well, shit. Wait, is this where I need to go to talk to the king? Like, did I, do I not need to convince the trolls to let me through and whatnot? Is this it? I mean, I'm supposed to speak to the king of arcs, and this is arcs. Maybe I've done it. Huh. I'm trying to think if I missed anything back there. Alright, so I'm on level one. Where was I before? Here? Okay, oh, Jesus. I, I can't make heads or tails of that. Alright, well, this is the first time I have been here since I originally played a long, long time ago. Let's see what's going on. Hello? Apologies if I'm breaking into someone's home. I have no idea what I'm doing. Oh, it's a church. <laughs> the music sometimes actually reminds me of Pathologic. It's kind of very strange and eerie. Oh, it's a tip. Did you know that you can steal from people? You need to have at least 50 in stealth to do this. <laughs> well, I don't have anywhere near. And it's funny, it would first tell me this tip when I'm near a freaking priest. Like, yeah, you want to steal from this godly man? Go for it. Heretic! What the fuck? I don't know you, and I don't trust you. Perhaps you have been sent by the devil. Please, leave me in peace. Heretic! Yeah, you know what? I changed my mind. I, if I could, I actually would steal from you. You're fucking crazy. And a massive douche. I should have been cooked. That's easier. Oh my god, I'm so gonna get lost in this place. Ah, oh, he didn't lock his door. Anything I can steal? I know. I'm gonna confuse the hell out of him and creep him out so much. I feel tired. Perfect. He'll ponder that until the end of his days. Wait a minute. No, I can do better. Come on, get on top of it. I don't even think it works as a table. Eh, okay. I'll stick with that. Are we in a cavern so large that I just can't see the top of it? Something up there but blackness. It's eerie. You know, it seems like a normal town, but you gotta keep in mind you're underground. <sighs> Carlo is your man. He's our boss. Alright, what am I supposed to speak to him anyway? It doesn't even say. Alright, I'm supposed to talk to him for some reason. I don't know why. Just continue exploring around. <laughs> Look at that. You have a running water texture and then it just... segues... just right into perfectly still water. Beautiful. Ah, old games. What is that? There's a scroll back there. Hold on. Hmm. 
think I better save it. <laughs> oh, there we go. Oh, pfft. It's like, it's like I have a jetpack attached to my back. Piece of wood and... Dispel field. That's a spell. Interesting. I don't have room for that, do I? No, I don't. Uh, I suppose I could always come back for it. Alright, hold on. Now the spell has been precast. Oh, wait, is that just a one time thing? Like, I didn't learn a new spell, I just got a one time cast of it? Is that what just happened? Yeah, because I don't have a new spell here. Okay, Dispel. Dispel. What, what does Dispel actually do? Dispel what? Like, Dispel debuffs or something? I don't know. Doesn't sound as special as I thought it would be, though. Oh, well. It's something. <laughs> the way these people walk around. Look at that. Come on. I want to see you walk again. Such a weird walk. You don't know me? I'm Alicia. And Gary the banker is my fiance. One day soon we will be wed, and then I shall be wealthy and powerful, as well as beautiful. I see. Do you not work with him? Work? Like a commoner? <gasps> Perish the thought. Why should I work when Gary is so fabulously rich? This character has an amazing amount of depth to her. So many different sides. Truly the best written character in RPG history. Gary is a rich and influential man. Oh, how I love him. I think that's basically the game telling me this man is rich, steal from him if you can. Wait, is this where I came from? That is where I came from. Alright, so I came out here, I went to the right. Well, I went to the left originally, through that door, ended up on the right. So let's go down here and see what's down. See what's going down down here? Hi. Guys having fun in here? Hello, A-man. I have an urgent message for the king. I am Carlo, captain of the guards. Our king, His Majesty Lunshire, is in the throne room. Go into the castle, through the double door of the room with columns in. The king should be there. Did it say through the double door of the room with columns in? What? I have to admit, I didn't even pay attention to what you said. I was kind of just... confused. And considering your face, which is actually amazingly lifelike. They actually did really impressive work with some of these faces. Have you looked in the throne room? No, I have not looked in the throne room. I'm sure I can find it just fine. Would it be considered stealing if I open the chest? Locked. Locked. Would they take it poorly if I <sighs> tried to pick lock? Pick the lock of the chest? Locked. It probably wouldn't work anyway. I'm just going to take all your food. <laughs> I don't even have room for it. Yeah, I really need to store my stuff somewhere. <sighs> That's another doggy. Oh, come here. Going to follow me around? Come on. Come on. There we go. Doggy, doggy, doggy. Well, I wonder how far he'll fall. Follow me. Down the steps? Yeah. All right, he's in for the long haul. Excuse me. Did, 
Did you just swallow something? What the hell was that gulp? <laughs> Look, I know it looks a little bit weird that I'm like grinding up against this man and grunting, but I, I, I seriously just want through. Oh, well. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. Ah, is this the bank? Okay, I can finally store my stuff, I think. Look, I'm a bit too busy to talk right now. What? Too busy staring at a wall? I bet I can take two Ilsids on my own. I don't think you could. Uh, could you please come to the window? Ding ding. Service, please. tell you that many people have tried to rob me, but I have here the very best locks, wards, and protections. That's in addition to the painfully well-paid guards. Might as well try to raid the king's coffers. You pay this lout a handsome sum? Hey, mate. Transaction mode. Beware, transaction is effective as soon as you pick up an item from or drop an item into the shopkeeper's chest. You cannot change your mind and no refunds are given. Okay. So this is where I buy stuff? Yes, it would appear. Uh, would appear. That is the case. <laughs> you can buy goblin mine shares? How does it even work? You can mess with shares? That sounds really cool. <laughs> And uh, apparently this is not actually where I store stuff, so damn it. Ah, <sighs> oh well. Another time, another day. I'll find somewhere to dump my powders. Hmm. Who does he think he is? If I get desperate, I su suppose I could just snort them all. <sighs> hmm. Is this my room? Even though I haven't ordered a room, but I could make it my room. I called Top Bunk. Oh, it didn't even go up there. There we go. Ooh, hey, can I get up there? Hey, I saw you up there. Hi, invisibility. Ooh, I don't know how long it lasts, but I could use that to steal stuff. I need some freaking room, though. I'm seriously so out of room. Okay, I'm just gonna eat some leeks. Got invisibility there. I need to learn these spells for real, though. Because I can only use them one time in their current form. Okay, well. I am well and truly lost in this damn city. But uh, I'm going to end this episode here. So in the next episode, I'm going to explore the rest of the city. Uh, try to speak to the king, and try to put somewhere to put my freaking wares so I actually have some room in my inventory. Because it's getting to be quite a mess. So, I hope you've enjoyed so far, and I'll be back soon.